another get question paper solve on this memory allocation on the topic memory allocation the question came in the year 2015 the thing is that consider six memory partitions of size 200 kb 400 kb 600 500 300 and 250 kb these partitions need to be allocated to four processes of sizes 357 kb 210 468 and 491 kb in that order so these partitions are to be allocated in this order only you cannot move here and there they they are to be treated in this order only if the best fit algorithm is used which partitions are not all allocated to any process so they are asking this one that we are having six partitions and we are having uh, four uh, processes are there so processes number is four partition number is six so at least two partitions will remain unallocated at least so that's why they are giving some answers we shall have to find out and here the algorithm is best fit algorithm so let me solve them so processes have written this one i mentioned that one in order and partitions are written accordingly okay now let me go for the best fit so 357 will be coming to this one 357 kb will be coming to this one so i shall be remaining with 43 kb then 210 210 will be coming to this best fit algorithm that means we are allocating processes to that particular memory hole or memory free space whose size is uh, greater than or equal to the current process size and that memory hole must be having the size minimum out of all the available memory holes that means the process will be allocated to that very memory hole whose size will be minimum but its size will be greater than or equal to the process size okay so now we are going for this 468 so 468 my idea says that it should be allocated here so it is 32 kb so now the last one is 491 491 should be allocated to there is no other way here only 491 kb okay so now 200 and 300 kb these two memory spaces will remain unallocated i shall have to find which option they are having in the answer so to have of the first option so yes so that is option is a so in this way whenever such question will come you shall have to do the tracing you should have to do the allocations and then please remember that you are supposed to calculate this difference this after doing the subtraction this difference has to be calculated because in the next process allocation this remaining free space might be coming in the consideration also so not only the blocks available given in the question paper but also after allocation of the process the remaining free space to that very remaining free space and the process can get allocated so please go on calculating this difference values so i think you are getting this logic i've done this particular problem solved in front of you thanks for watching this video